Hey y'all, it's your girl, Everything Me and back again with another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about how you apply your own nails at home. Um, I was a big nail gore before the pandemic. Now I'm just like, ah. And really, it wasn't really even that that made me uh, change my mind about how I get my nails applied or how I apply my nails in general. It was the simple fact that I kept going to salons and getting um, a nail fungus. And that's just simply because people who don't take care of their nails or just don't have the knowledgeability or even um, the capability to take care of their nails just kind of transport it. And they also don't take care of their tools the way that they're supposed to. So let's get into how to apply your nails. Like, And it's very easy. And if you do press-ons, um, I would very much recommend this over just using nail glue. I'm going to use um, gel glue, like gel nail glue. It is top tier, y'all. It's easy because I know that I apply them the way that they're supposed to apply and be applied, and it's a very easy takeoff. So if you're this far to the video, don't forget to hit like, comment, subscribe, join the go. Gang, 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 we live over here. That's on period six. If you ain't got no go, set some, achieve some. The time is now. If you needed a message or a memo, it's me. Let's get it done. 2022, we're coming after everything that God has ordained for us. And don't you ever forget it. So let's get into the video, y'all. All right, so the nail kit that I got is this Beatles nail kit. I got this off Amazon and it came with a little mini light as well and the reason that I got it was because I was very inspired from a TikTok. It, it comes with this um, LED light but the only thing is it doesn't come with um, you know an adapter at the end. So I was very excited number one because it's just like oh my gosh so like super easy to apply them and I can do my nails the way that I like them to be done because I'm very particular when it comes to my nails so I'm going to show you guys how I do all that it came with like I said a UV lamp came with glue it came with over a hundred nail tips and all in different sizes so let's get into the application all right so I'm going to push back my cuticles with this little tool that I got and it came in this kit that I got off Amazon I will make sure that I link this below for you guys to get um, if you don't push back your cuticles it is going to be very hard for the nail or the nail glue in the nail to stick to the nail plate so you just want to make sure you get all of the extra skin or whatever else that's on your nail bed and I'm just going ahead and doing that after I finish this I will be right back all right so now that is done I'm going to just file my nails just a little bit the nail bed to get the shine and everything off and I'm also going to actually I'm going to clip my nails first so I'm just gonna give them a little snippy snip a little clippy clip and you don't have to do this this is just something that I prefer to do because my nails are super like super raggedy I'm not gonna say super raggedy but they just I always hit them I always break them off all right so now after doing so like I said, I'm going to file my nails just a little bit. And for me, I've just noticed that the nails stick easier and stay on easier. You do not have to do this, but I have very oily um, nail beds. So this is just what works for me. You have to do what works for you and what you know works. All right, so I'll be back after I finish buffing or following the shine off my nails all right so now after i'm done i'm just going to take this gel um mini ph bond it's a dehydrator so i'm just going to take this and apply that to my nails just to dehydrate the nail and that is like the key y'all All right, so now that that's done, let's get into applying these nails. Okay, so I'm probably gonna start with my left hand first. That's just what I do, I, I don't know why. So I've clipped them to the length that I want them to be, and this is the nail glue. This is what it looks like. So I'm just gonna put the glue in the tip of the nail just a little bit, and I'm just gonna drag it down just a little bit as well. And I'm not going to put it all the way to the top because it's just going to spread anyways once you apply it onto your nail. So I'm going to show you guys here. 
Let me move all of these out of the way. So now here we go. Ooh, hold on, wait, now y'all. Ah, hold on, wait, now sometimes I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I am not a pro at this. So sometimes I'll be messing up y'all. And I do. So I just hold it for a little bit and try to remove the glue that kind of was not flush when I applied it. So yeah. And I'm gonna hold this under here for 30 seconds to a minute. Now y'all, I know my cut is not even, but don't judge me because I'm going to file the nails anyway after um, the glue cures and all that good stuff. So it is completely fine. And these nails will last me for about two weeks before they come off. And I just make sure I let my nails breathe for a couple days and prep prime and do the same thing over again. All right, so now that I'm done with that, I'm going to file my nails and make sure they are super straight, like how I like them. And just make sure the angle isn't weird. All right, so after I'm done following these, um, so this is what they're looking like right now. Oh gosh, hold on, let me focus this. So this is what they're looking like right now. But once I'm done following them on both sides, and this is what this hand is looking like, they're very uneven. They're very uneven, so. Once I finish following them, I am going to be back. All right, so now this is what we're looking like. Um, I'm gonna do a little close up. So this is what we're looking like right now. I'm gonna go wash all of this dust off of my hands from filing and then we're going to be back. All right, so we're gonna take this and we're just gonna buff the shine off the nail. It just makes it easier for the polish and the coats to stick. So this is what your nails should look like after buffing off the shine. So I'm gonna do this to all of my nails and then I'm gonna do this to all of, all of my nails and then I'll be back. All right, so for the base coat, I'm going to be using this 10 over 10 uh, base coat. Yeah, so I'm gonna lay this down right now. All right, so this color that I'm going to be using is 0594, and this is the brand that it's by. I will make sure I link these polishes in the description box. So um, I'm probably gonna do two coats if I have to, I'm not sure. And these also have to be, these are gel polishes as well. So these have to be cured before you can move on.
All right, so I'm going to paint each nail and then be back and talk about the top coat that I'm gonna use. All right, so now I'm going to take this Cure um, Gel Top Coat and I'm going to place this over. Oh, I'm gonna need some help opening it. I'm probably gonna call my husband. Josh! All right, so I actually gotta open by myself. So I'm probably just gonna start with um, my left hand first. Okay, will it come out? Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna start with my left hand first. Let us see. Ooh, I hate when hair still sticks to my nails. That is literally the worst. So I don't know, it seems very thin so far, but I don't know, let's see what happens after I cure it. I, I'm not sure, I don't know, I don't know how to feel about it, guys. All right, so I'm not gonna lie, guys, this is curing down super fast. I really love the um, look that it's giving on the nails. Like, it's, it's definitely giving, and it cures very quickly. So I'm gonna make sure I link this in the description. This Cure um, Gel Genius Top Coat by London Town. I'll make sure I link the description or link in the description where to get it from because it's drying down super fast, y'all. Like, no cap. I'm not even gonna cap to y'all. Like, it's not even taking a whole 30 seconds to cure, even though I'm gonna leave it in there for 30 seconds. All right, so this is what we're looking like so far. Like, I'm like a lot. I'm really liking it. I'm really really. It. Now, I know my painting could use some work. I, I know that, guys. I know and I understand that. But, um, yeah, but right now it's definitely giving. So, after I finish this, I'm going to be back to show you guys the final result. All right, so this is what we're looking like. Right now, I know I have to go and clean up, like, everything around um, my nail bed. But, I mean, I feel like it came out super nice. Like, they look super pretty. Um... It will probably be some things that I do differently the next time. But right now, I feel like this, ooh, I got palms on my hands going. All right, y'all, so that is it for today's video. Every product that I used will be linked below in the description box. Um, yeah, I feel like these nails, this is something that I probably will be doing every two weeks simply because I won't have to go to the salon and y'all, the salon is just not for me right now. It's just not. Um, so. If you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, join the goal, gang, gang, gang. <laughs> we lit and that's on period sis. If you ain't got no goals, say something to you some the time is now. If you need a message or a memo, it's me. Let's get it done. 2022, we're coming after everything that God has ordained for us and don't you ever forget it. Don't forget to head on over to my page and check out other videos. Um, yeah, and I'll see y'all next week with another video. Gotta shine now